Hi everyone, welcome back to The Chosen One by Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for your support. Today's word is God said, hold on onto what you know. You will change everything completely wherever you go. God wants you to hold on to everything. Because I'm going to tell you something. God wants you to hold on to everything because whatever's in you, is going to be used and it's going to bless somebody. It's going to help somebody. In James 2 and 8, it reads, If you really fulfill the royal law according to the scriptures, you shall love your neighbors as yourself. You are doing well. You have to learn how to spread the gospel to people. They need to know the truth now. People are walking around this world and they need to know the scriptures they need to know about god they need to know prayer they need to know about fasting they need to know everything so god said hold on to what you know because whatever you know inside of you is going to bless somebody in front of you behind you next to you it's going to touch your neighbors everywhere you go everywhere you go somebody need help Yes, God says somebody going to need help. Somebody going to need you to pray for them. Everywhere you go, somebody need help. I want y'all to understand this. Sometimes I go into the store. Sometimes I'm in the bathroom and I get stopped. When God allow you to do something, you have no choice. You got to obey what God tell you to do. You can be anywhere in the bathroom. You can be outside on the train, whatever. When God tell you to pray for somebody, when God tell you to do something for somebody, he will allow something to stop in order for you to get to that person. I'm telling you, if he had to stop the bus for you to talk to somebody, he would do it. Because God needs you to bless somebody. Somebody. Somebody around you needs to be blessed, God's saying. Somebody around you need a change. Somebody around you need to hear your word. Hallelujah. God says somebody around you need to hear your voice. Your voice is getting ready to bless this person's life. They was getting ready to give up. They was getting ready to quit. They was getting ready to just say, Lord, I can't do this no more. But your voice saved them. Your voice changed them. God said, hold on. Hold on unto what you know. You will change everything completely. Wherever you go, you want to change somebody's life. Everywhere you go, you're going to have scriptures in your mind. You're going to quote it. You're going to help somebody. You're going to change somebody's life. God said you are, listen, God said you are somebody's angel. God said you are the change in their life. God said, y'all, y'all not understanding. God said you done changed somebody's life. By them listening to you, they didn't give up. Hallelujah. Shabbat, I thank you, Jesus. They didn't, they didn't give up because they heard your voice. They was getting ready to jump off the bridge. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They was getting ready to end their life. They was getting ready to do something in their life, but they heard your voice. They heard you praying in that bathroom. They heard you saying something to God. God, have mercy on your people. God, touch your people. They heard your voice. And by them hearing your prayer, by them hearing you praying by they hearing you praying for somebody else on the phone they said i'm not gonna do this i'm not gonna do this because i see what her god can do i see what his god can do hallelujah hallelujah god is doing some changes hallelujah god will do the change god will do the change in somebody else's life around you everywhere you go everywhere you go Somebody going to be changed. Somebody going to be delivered. Somebody going to be saved. Somebody going to be set free. I want to say be encouraged. It's going to be hard, but be encouraged. Don't give up. Keep praying. Hold on to God and allow God to be your source. Anytime when you feel tired, get some rest and pray. Ask God to help you. God, God is very important and God allow us to do more for him because he get the glory out of us in spite of what we going through God want the glory start praising God start lifting his name up more and just start putting God first the more we put God first the more we will be blessed you'll be blessed when you put God first in your life thank you for watching I love you all be encouraged don't give up but pray about it thank you again for watching stay blessed